Good morning, we're in. We're here for two weddings. It's getting hot. So we're off to get some breakfast at... Uh, Australian Dairy Farm. What company? <laughs> Taylor's videos from Sam Taylor's on TikTok always comes up. So we're in TST, we're staying on Kowloon side because both the weddings are here and it is a brisk 27 degrees. We're walking 100 meters, which feels like it's already been 700 meters to breakfast. And here we are, it's the line. And it keeps going. And it keeps going. I don't even know where the actual store is. Oh, there it is. We are almost, almost there. Wow. The review is it was delicious. We spent 147 Hong Kong dollars. We got two sets. We got the pudding, which was probably the most expensive part, like 33 Hong Kong dollars. And then Justin also got an extra ham sandwich. Um, and I'm super full now. Sign of a good meal. Nice latte with oat milk. Let me do a taste test. Actually, pretty good. Tastes like Australia's latte. <laughs> Twelve bucks Australian. Gotta drink every last sip of this. We are at a random food place called the Dragon City Cafe. We're getting a little snack before the wedding. We've just got ready for the wedding. We're going to the Rosewood. I was like, maybe we'll stay there since the wedding's there. Tell me why the rooms are like six thousand dollars a night AUD. Anyway, wearing the pink dress from Misha. Oh, that's a nice. This is that's pretty. Nice that's nice. That's nice. Ah. Good morning. We're going to the recovery boat party for better or for worse. I already decided I wasn't going anymore. Then last minute we decided we were going to go. So let's hope we make it. Got my whole bag of medicines here with me. Got my hydrolyte water. Wish me luck. Just got off the boat, survived, it was rough. Had a snack at Red Tea, which is like a really popular chain restaurant, which does like Hong Kong cafe style food. Delicious, they really know how to make their eggs here. The scrambled eggs are just something else. Probably full of MSG, not complaining, I love MSG. And now we are preparing ourselves for wedding number two. <laughs> our hectic way of securing all our luggage. Just checked into our second hotel, just had yum cha after that 13 course wedding banquet last night. So we're staying in Wan Chai on Hong Kong Island at the Hari. The Hari, I think it's a new hotel, it's really nice. You walk in, have the bathroom. I love these glass doors. And then we are so high up right now, we're in level 27. A little bit scary. Walking back to Justin's old neighborhood. That's his overpass that he used to walk on every day to get to work. Justin's old apartment, right in this building. Yeah, in Central, going around the shopping centers, stealing the air conditioning. Thank God there's some breeze now because your girl was about to pass out before. dinner now at Carbone with Nick and Kat. We're gonna change it up a little. We're having Italian tonight. We've been having a little bit too much char tanting. He wants to show you his new shoes. They're gonna get so dirty. <laughs> Are we sharing? Massive cheese is coming our way. <laughs> Me. Usually suggest to try the lobster ravioli first. It's a little bit more delicate. <laughs> Struggling up the hill. Right. Justin, take us to McDonald's. You know what the vibes are. McDonald's on a Sunday night at 2 a.m. Woke up this morning, had breakfast with mum. Then I got some fish cake noodles. This smells so good. It's only 700 meters to the next place and mum had the bright idea that she wanted to walk it. And we're on the steepest hill. And we're both 
dying. Went to try on some bridal dresses here in Hong Kong. The shopping vibe is very different. The first one was very like rush, 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 in and out. Okay, you're done, go. They're nice in the way that you can try on three dresses for free if you just like like their Facebook profile or their Instagram account. And then also some of the places here do dress rentals as well, which is very a good idea. And then tonight we've got a pack because it's our last day in Hong Kong. And uh, here's how it's going on the last day in Hong Kong. <laughs> It is pre-dinner snack time. Mm. That one's nice. I got pear, kumquat, ginger, and hers is pomegranate. Oh. 